there weren't any ghosts. Not that I wanted to see one. Being scared made me more tired than usual. I better go to bed. Oh, the teddy bear. Oh, well. We'll take care of it tomorrow. <sighs> yesterday. Expectations. Master, help! Ah, I'm gonna get eaten! That's not going to happen. I made up that story. I don't care. Just help me! Wait, you made it all up? Mm hmm. It was just a little touch to scare you even more, and it worked like a charm. Jeez, I don't eat people. I apologize. I didn't mean to insult you, beautiful young ghost lady. Oh, please. I'm not that beautiful. Well, what are you doing making small talk with her? She's a ghost! A ghost! I don't get to talk to ghosts very often. I can't pass up this opportunity to actively engage her in conversation. Where are my manners? Here, have a seat. Rorona, can you prepare some tea for us? Don't mind me. I can't sit or drink tea. I'm a ghost. Uh, what is going on? So basically, you don't remember anything from when you were alive, Miss Pamela? Oh, just call me Pamela. like a normal girl. Okay then, what are you thinking of doing from now on, Pamela? I haven't really thought about it. I didn't really choose to come here. She's not that scary, even though she is a ghost. Wow, she doesn't have feet either, just like a real ghost. Hmm, then why don't you stay here until you decide what to do? Are you sure? That'll help me a lot. Her hair is so fluffy. She's pretty cute, too. Huh? What? Hair? No! Absolutely not! Do you want to kick this poor, beautiful girl out onto the street? If so, then why did you bring her here in the first place? It's not like I knew. Plus, she's a ghost. And also, it's really weird of you to be so nice. Well, excuse me. So are you saying that what I really want is to watch you be afraid of a ghost? See? I knew it! You're Rorona, right? Nice to meet you. Ah! Stay away from me! Excellent. This will keep things interesting for a while. 